booktube it's thea and it is spookathon day one i am so excited for this readathon it's one of my favorite readathons to participate in it's just so much fun it's super casual and super chill so i'm really excited that it is officially here um i reasonably don't know how much reading i'm gonna get done this week just because it is the first official week at my new job and I'm not going to be able to read as much as I used to. So all of my reading is going to be done like on my commute back and forth to work. A little bit on my lunch and then like at night when I get home. So I've chosen books that I hope will be really fast paced reads. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and start City of Ghosts, Victoria Schwab. This will be my first book for the readathon. I feel like it's a really fast paced book. It's a middle grade. Um, it's like 280 pages or so. So this is something that I could quickly get through. Um, maybe it'll help keep my momentum going. So I'm going to go ahead and start with City of Ghosts. I am so excited to read this. I have been waiting for this for like ever. Um, and I didn't want to read it when it first came out because I knew it was something that I wanted to read in October and it was something that I was going to try to read for Spookathon because it is a middle grade novel with really big font and Victoria's writing is just super fast paced. Um, so I'm really excited to dive into this. Um, but I have to go shower and get ready for work. So I just wanted to pop in and say hello. Happy Spookathon. And, um, I'll check in with you guys a little bit later. with another update. It's about 5.40 or so. I just got off work. Um, I headed to the bus to go home. Um, today was a good, like, official first, like, my first Monday of my new job, so that's really good. Um, I'm, like, picking up on everything, and as far as reading, um, it's all right. It's not as much as I would have liked, but it's kind of just, like, uh, I'm gonna have to, like, get used to the fact that like, I just can't read a lot anymore during the day. Um, I have read 30 pages in City of Ghosts, so that's like not bad. Um, really enjoying it, absolutely like loving it so far. I just love Victoria Schwamm and her writing, um, but I am off to the grocery store to pick up food for the week. I hope everyone has a great night, happy reading, happy spook spookathon, and I'll check in with you guys a little bit later. Bye! guys Thea with another update um it's pretty late it's about 11 o'clock or so and um I just really wanted to get to like a good stopping spot in City of Ghost so I have read a total so I read another 100 pages tonight um so I'm just about halfway through I am at page 131 I just finished part two so and that was a good stopping spot before going off to bed um, I didn't reach my daily reading count because I would have had to read this whole thing in order to meet my daily reading count, but I actually did a lot more than I was planning, um, just because all of my reading got done at night, so, um, but I am just absolutely loving this. I, oh, it's just so adorable and just so, like, sweet, and it's got so many Harry Potter references, which I love, um, and it's giving me like serious like 
travel bug vibes and wanting to go to Scotland. Um, but I hope everyone had a great first day. I hope everyone had is enjoying what they're reading. Um, I am off to bed. I probably will get up a little bit earlier, um, a little early tomorrow morning just so I can get a little bit of reading done. Um, because I, even though readathons are like really fun and reading as much as possible, I'm one of those people that I have to at least get a good night's sleep, um, or I'm just like, can't function. And since it is, I'm still in my new job, it's not responsible to show up like exhausted. So I'm gonna head off to bed, but I hope everyone had a great first day. I hope everyone is enjoying, is enjoying what they're reading, and I will see you guys in the AM. Good night. Good morning, booktube. Happy Spookathon day two. Um, it's about 5.45. I got up a little extra early and showered um, so I can go ahead and sit down and read City of Ghosts for like 20 minutes or so. Um, but I will check in with you guys um, after I read a little bit more. I hope you guys have a great Tuesday. Happy Spookathon day two and I'll see you guys a little later. Bye. So it is about 6.20. Um, I didn't get as much as I reading as a ton as I'd like just because I am still a little sleepy but I did manage to get through 20 pages of City of Ghost. Um, I am just, I love this so much. It always amazes me that Victoria is able to switch between like adult and YA and like now middle grade and she just, it's amazing how she can still have her writing style but like with the different audiences it's just absolutely amazing absolutely love it it's kind of the perfect like just spooky fall halloween read um and so now i'm officially more than halfway through so my plan is just to get as much of this done as today as possible hopefully finish the rest of it um, if it continues, if I continue at this pace, I do feel like I could definitely get this finished today. Um, but I think I'm going to go back to sleep for another half hour or so um, before I have to really be up for work. And I'll see you guys a little later. Bye. Hey guys, Sia here with another update. Um, uh, it's about 9.30, so I'm just getting ready to head into work, but I really quickly wanted to pop in and give you guys an update about my morning. Um, my bus was a little early, so I got to sit at Starbucks and have a quick breakfast and do a little bit of reading, which was really nice. So I read another like 20 pages or so um, in City of Ghosts, so I'm up to 100 and page 170. So I'm really confident that I can get it finished today. I have about a half an hour for lunch and then a half hour commute on my way home. So I definitely have at least another hour of reading. I quickly just wanted to pop in, give you guys a quick update on how the morning went. I'll check in with you guys a little bit later. Bye. Hey guys, it's Sia with another update. Um, it's about 5.45, I just got off work. Um, it is pouring rain, you can't see, um, but because I'm covered, but it is pouring rain. So I decided I didn't want to walk to the bus stop in the rain, um, so I called an Uber, uh, which should be here in a few minutes, but I just wanted to quickly give you guys an update. I read about 14 pages on my lunch, um, so I'm up to page 174 in City of Ghosts. My boyfriend and I decided that we're not gonna go to a movie tonight, so my goal tonight is just to finish reading City of Ghosts, maybe even start something else um but i really quickly just wanted to pop in and give you guys an update about how um my lunch break went so you guys um probably in the a.m you might see me later tonight you might not um but if not i hope you guys have a great night and i'll see you guys later bye hey guys um i wasn't gonna pop in until i had done more reading but i got a package in the mail i know what this is um it's my pre-order for what if it's us I'm so excited that it's finally here. Um, this is like my 
like one of my top five most anticipated books of the year and I have been waiting. Um, I ordered it from Books of Wonder because it was going to be signed and personalized and I feel, felt it would be great to open it with you guys on camera. So um, let's go ahead and take a look. This box is like, this box is being impossible to open. Oh, I got a cute little Books of Wonder bookmark. I will say, I love when you order from Books of Wonder and you like have it shipped. They always package it really nice and so it doesn't get like messed up. And especially since it was, it's been, it was raining here today, so it's really nice that this um, is packaged really well. So I really like that um, they make sure that it's like, doesn't get all messed up. But now on the other side of that, it takes longer to open. Okay. Oh my god, you guys are so excited. It's like shiny and oh, oh it's beautiful you guys oh my god not expecting this reaction um but I am so excited and I have been wanting this I have been patiently waiting and patiently waiting for this to come in the mail and it's finally here and it's absolutely gorgeous and adorable and it's personalized and oh. um I was not expecting to Cry like this, um, but I'm so happy that this is finally in my possession and in my hands. Um, and I cannot wait to read this. I really want to read it right now, but with Spookathon being here, um, I'm gonna wait until Spookathon is over. But I am just so happy that this is finally in my possession. Um, so yeah, I really just wanted to um, open that with you guys on camera. But I um, hope you guys are having a great night, and I'll check in later. Bye. with the last update for Spookathon Day 2. I ended up finishing City of Ghosts of Victoria Schwab and giving it like 4.5 out of 5 stars. Absolutely loved it. Um, it's my highest rated book all month, which was great, but I ended up reading the last like 60 pages or so um, tonight and I just, it was uh, so much fun and just so sweet and uh, just, uh, I love Victoria's writing so much and this was her first middle grade novel, I absolutely loved it. It was such a quick, fast-paced read. It was like the perfect thing for a readathon. I think I'm gonna go ahead and pick up probably uh, the Babysitter's Guide to Monster Hunting since it's my other quick, since it's my other short book, and it'll only probably take a day, a uh, day and a half or so. I um, really quickly wanted to pop in before I head to bed. Um, it's about 11:15 or so, so I'm getting ready to head to bed, and I just wanted to pop in and let you guys know my final update for. 
for day two. Um, so the total page count for day two is 130 pages, I believe, or so. Um, but I am really enjoying the reading plan so far. I'm happy reading, and um, I will see you guys in the morning. Good night.